In today's video, I'm going to be driving a car and doing a bunch of other activities in my camping trip this video. It's going to be so cool and super epic, so make sure to stick around to the entire video. And yeah, thank you. But first, to actually understand how the hell I got here, we have to go back a couple of days. A couple of days ago, my father asked me if he, I wanted to go on a camping trip with him on, from Friday to Sunday. And I absolutely said yes, because I thought this would be a great opportunity to explore and show, share a little video with you guys of me doing some incredible stuff outside and some really fun activities. So, without further ado, let's get into today's video. Rightio, here we are. First activity was me biking through this beautiful river. Absolutely beautiful. The water is so still. And once you get through the rapids, there is a beautiful river slash lake that is very beautiful to swim in. And it's got a nice deep hole. Rightio, here we are at the creek. We have reached the rapids. It's pretty darn intense. It's pretty crazy. I really got to paddle for this one. Hopefully the flow in the creek is strong enough and the water's deep enough that I can actually just don't have to get out of this canoe and just hopefully I can just paddle through it. Oh, Jesus. This is intense. Oh, I don't think it's going to let me, guys. It's way too strong. Oh, well. Oh, there's trees. Almost got hit by them. All right, well, let's paddle back and begin the next activity, which is, trust me guys, the activity is gonna get much cooler and much more epic. So let's do it. All right, next activity, I'm going to be cooking some sausages so we can actually, uh, cause we're gonna, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to be using these sausages as bait because we're gonna go fishing on the kayak in the creek. And we're gonna try and catch some fish cause that's going to be the next activity. But this is also a semi, side activity so let's cook up some sausages real quick all right next activity here we are got some sausages we're gonna cook up one sausage maybe two i don't know and we are going to cook it on the barbie and we're going to hopefully use this as fish bait i don't know how it's gonna go it probably might go trash i actually don't know uh that's pretty <laughs> oh it's pretty funny oh, blah, blah, blah. all right we're gonna chuck this on the barbie let's freaking do this all right yeah we're just gonna cook this up we're gonna give it a little twirl you know Spin it around, give it some spikes, just so it can spit out the fat in case it makes any, which it will. So yeah, we're just gonna roll this around and give it a nice little cook. Welcome to That Guy Josh's cooking show. As you can see, this sausage is in prime condition and has nice texture of charcoal. As you can see, this, it's very beautiful and the texture is just absolutely incredible. We're going to absolutely cook the hell out of this so the fish get a nice treat and then we're going to yank them and eat them. Alright, that's one sausage cooked. Let's take that off the heat. Pop that there. I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm going to grab that sausage, stab it. Very nice. Grab that. Turn off the gas. My father's coming through with a lawnmower. Love to see. And we're just going to chop this up. Rightio, we are back in the creek. I've got my fishing rod. I've got a sausage that I cooked up earlier today. And we've got that as bait. Hopefully, I don't know how that's going to go. Um, this might be a short camp, fishing trip. I don't know. It's going to be fine. It's going to be good. And I've got a nice little beverage, a little Fanta. You already know how it is. And yeah, hopefully we catch some fish. If we do, that'll be absolutely very surprising because I don't know if they like sausages. Um, but we'll have to see. Hopefully we catch one. That'll be good content. And yeah, let's go to the fishing spot. Uh, there is a hole up here. It's pretty darn deep and I reckon there's gonna be some fish lurking within that water. So, let's paddle there. Uh, there's a nice shore so we can actually just, don't have to fish off our canoe. And yeah, let's bloody do this. All right, here we are, we're at the spot. Look at this beautiful, absolutely amazing lake. It is beautiful. We got a fishing rod, got some bait, got a chopped up sausage. Don't know how long it's gonna last me. Probably not long. But yeah, we're gonna see if we get any bites, see if we get any fish. A fish would be really cool. We got a beverage, we got a fancy down there. Freaking Beetlejuice, Jenna Ortega's on there. I don't know why. They must have done the collaboration. Anyway, that's very irrelevant. Anyway, we're gonna put this sausage on this line and cast it out. I'll tell you when we cast it out. All right. All righty -o. we've got a bait, freaking sausage, pretty cool. All right, we're gonna cast it out. Let's see if we get any bites. Probably not. Who knows, let's be positive though. That was a pretty bad cast, but we'll have to see. Let's just release the slack, and let's see. 
Alright, first attempt didn't go so well, but when I tried like luring it out, um, it got hooked. Like it got stuck on my reel and it flung off my hook and into the ocean. Um, or river. And also, that doesn't help. That's like cooked, that's bent. My fishing rod's so old and like it's cooked. Anyway, it still works. Let's cast this out and let's freaking, if we catch a fish with this bait, this is gonna be such a miracle. All right, Eric, I've reeled out somewhere over there in that direction. I don't know, maybe we'll get a fish. If we do, I'll be actually like so happy. Got a nice beverage, got freaking Fanta Beetlejuice. Pretty cool. Ah, this is the life, I'm telling you. Ah, sometimes, you know, really the real reason I'm making this video is just to, I don't know, just for something different and to fresh, a breath of fresh air, you know. And also, it's just to, just to say that sometimes in life, you just gotta go remote. You just gotta clear your head of all the crazy stuff that's happening in your life. You might have something traumatic that's bothering you, but so just maybe you, being out in nature is what would clear your head. And, but I don't know, I'm not you. But yeah, this is a very different video to you, my usual videos and it's probably isn't gonna get much views because it's not in the same niche as my general niche. But yeah, we'll see. This video is just to, just to say that don't wish the time away and stay in the present and enjoy life as it is right now and a bunch of other stuff. I don't know, all of this is kind of corny, I know, maybe, not really, but it's true. You don't want life to go fast. Thought I got a bite just then. You wanna take it slow and steady and you wanna take, you wanna admire every second of life. No matter how hard, annoying, sad, or embarrassing it may be, everything that you do in life leads up to something. Uh, but yeah, that's my quick yap session. I will update you guys if I find a fish. Oh, there's a fish just jumped right over there. Um, I don't know how well the sausage bait's gonna go. Probably not well. But yeah, I'll update you guys if I get a bite or like if I find a fish or something. <laughs> yeah, these fish are not liking my sausages whatsoever. I haven't got a single freaking bite on this thing. Hang on, let me. Oh my God. Jesus Christ. I haven't got a single freaking bite. There's no bites. Look, absolutely none. So obviously they don't like sausages, which is fair enough. I mean, I wouldn't really, I could be kind of sus if there was a freaking sausage, cooked sausage swimming in the middle of the ocean. Um, but yeah, fishing did not go well. Anyway, let's head back home. My father has instructed me to drive and get his phone because he's too lazy to walk a couple meters. So I guess I have to drive there. By the way, YouTube, don't kill me. I am under the supervision of my father. This is private property. We own this. Thank you very much. Now we drive out. Car's screaming at me to put a seatbelt on. Safety first. All right, let's go. The car's still beeping, that's quite weird. Um, did I leave a door open? Let's check. Why are you screaming at me? This car's screaming at me. It's like beep, beep, beep. Eh, who cares? My father has generously mowed the lawn for us, so that's awesome. Let's get some footage of me driving. Sorry for making you guys fall over. My camera tripod's just acoustic. Alright, here's this fire. Let's grab him. Uh, what the frick? The hell? Let's see what charge his phone is on. Uh, what's this? It's not freaking telling me. 95. Oh, it's chill. Alright, let's collect his phone, bring it back to him. Let's do this. Alright, let's drive. Freaking. Oh my god, I hope you guys can see that. Alright. Oh Jesus, it's screaming at me again. I don't know why it's screaming at me. It's bloody screaming at me. I don't like it when it screams at me. All right, let's drive. Now we're just gonna you around, you turn around or whatever. My father is waiting for his delivery. Ah, oh, job well done. One of my favorite things about driving is that the freedom and versatility you get. I don't know if versatility is the right word, but I just, when I'm driving, especially when I was a kid and I got to 
be able to like, drive in my father's lap. I felt like I had the power. I was felt really powerful, and I felt like I could do anything. I felt like I was flying a spaceship or whatever. Um, it was really cool, and I was like, it felt so modern and like advanced. I was like, oh my god, I can't believe I'm actually driving this or moving this or whatever. Well, I felt like I was, but my dad was actually on the pedals and stuff, and I felt like I was at the top of the world or something. So yeah, it's just, I've always loved driving. I always loved that aspect of driving. And always remember, drive safe. Don't be an idiot. And also don't do what I'm doing right now. I'm a trained professional. Um, don't drive with your phone. It's stupid and you'll freaking die. So, yeah. Um, let's get to the next activity. Let's see what's on the radio today. This is a banger. Oh my God, this is so good. Is this Travis Scott? Oh yeah. This is fire. Yeah. All right, next activity, we are going to be doing mowing. We're going to mow this massive area of land. It's going to be absolutely incredible. I had to stop recording uh, when I went for a swim and I couldn't record that and I had to do other stuff um, that I couldn't really record either. But yeah, we're back. We're going to keep doing activities. Let's do some mowing. Let's go. All right, next activity, we're going to be doing some mowing. This is going to be so fun. I hope you guys are enjoying this video. Leave a thumbs up and comment. Camping, if you're watching to this this far. All right, let's do some mowing. Radio. now that we've done that, we can go over and mow the other section, which actually I don't know if there's another section, but let's see if there's more work to do, more mowing, more satisfaction. Alrighty, I found a patch of land that is good to mow. We're gonna mow this area and maybe back there, over there as well. Um, it's gonna be awesome. Let's freaking do it. And that is how it's done. We have lawn mowed, mowed, uh, we've mowed all over there that is absolutely beautiful look how flat that is now that is so nice apart from like all the mowed up grass how far can i zoom that's pretty cool okay on, i'm getting distracted anyway yeah we have mowed all of that that is beautiful look how flat and amazing that is that looks so good now and then over here we've mowed this part it's beautiful it looks very approachable now and it does not look like an overgrown jungle now and that is amazing let's go on to the next activity oh my god this is insane i'm currently in the middle of the amazon jungle getting chased by 10 bears and all i've got is a lawnmower to escape please help I was doing some exploring on the, in, with the, um, my vehicle escaping from the um, bears. And look what I found. Absolutely incredible, massive tree in the middle of this freaking circle forest thing. I, it might be circle, I don't know. I think that's where I uh, camped last time I was here. Um, it's just a massive circle. And in the middle is this massive tree. Imagine building a tree house in that, that'd be actually so cool. Um, but yeah, that was, that's pretty cool. All right. Oh, big stretch. Oh, okay. It's the next morning. Um, hope you guys have enjoyed this video. This is going to be the last thing before I wrap up this awesome camping Sigma video. So yeah.